Manchester United will fully turn their focus on Sunday and an FA Cup quarterfinal clash against Fulham now, with Europa League progression and next round opponents sorted. United ground out a 1-0 win in Seville to secure a 5-1 aggregate win over Real Betis, barely touching the ground in Manchester Airport before learning of another trip to southern Spain and a two-legged tie against Sevilla. But preparations for a fourth Spanish opposition this season can wait until after the international break, with a massive game against Fulham at Old Trafford to come on Sunday. The cottagers will fancy themselves for a big upset as they look to add silverware to an already brilliant season. Elsewhere, Sir Jim Ratcliffe led a delegation who met with the United hierarchy on Friday as he looks to enter the next stage of the bidding process. Representatives of Qatari banker Sheikh Jassim bin Hamad Al Thani visited Old Trafford on Thursday and he is expected to lodge a second offer in the coming days. Kyle Newbold How would you line up versus Fulham tomorrow? This widget requires JavaScript to work. Pick the team Kyle Newbold Anthony Marshall and Anthony Latest Eric Ten Hag has admitted that Anthony Marshall and Anthony are unlikely to feature for the Reds against Fulham at the weekend. United were without attacking duo Marshall and Anthony for Thursday's trip to Spain, with the Brazilian ace sidelined through illness, while the French striker was not fit enough to feature, despite returning to training. Ten Hag was asked about the two absentees during his pre-Fulham press conference on Friday. He suggested they are doubts for the clash at the weekend. Kyle Newbold Eric Ten Hag met Sir Jim Ratcliffe Eric Ten Hag met Sir Jim Ratcliffe on Friday morning as the Manchester-born businessman visited Carrington during talks over his bid to buy the club. The Ineos boss was at Old Trafford early in the morning for talks with United figures, including Chief Executive Richard Arnold, before heading to Carrington for a tour of the training ground. Ten Hag was at Carrington before holding his press conference to preview the Fulham game and he was introduced to Ratcliffe at the training ground. I just met them, we shake hands, I'm focused on the game. We play a big game on Sunday. All our focus is on that. Others in the club are dealing with potential investors, said Ten Hag. Read the full story here greater than greater than greater than 2236 Kyle Newbold Morning Reds. Good morning all and welcome to our Live United blog this Saturday. Stay tuned throughout the day to keep up to date with all things going on around M16.